good morning everyone there is today's topic that is fusion vectors so as you all know fusion vector uh, first of all we have to introduce about vector what is vector that is a fully assembled plasmid that is known as vehicle which is carried out some transfer some new gene of interest into another there is two types of gene fusion that is known as transcriptional fusion and translation fusion vectors so what is fusion vector that is known as gene fusion so as we all see in the like uh, diagram that will be so it is also known as operon fusion then operon fusion and protein fusion is a type of fusion vectors transcriptional and translation that is carried out in the vector that known as fusion vector the operon fusion a coding sequence that retain its own translation start site and signal which is fused to transcriptional signal of another gene so as you all know there is a operon can be cut and passed together make operon fusion the operon having optocan and lactose operon then the promoter operator gamma gene a gene that is known as <coughs> mrna and beta galactosidase containing plasmid and introduced into the vector that is known as fusion vector after that gene fusion in the protein fusion two coding sequences are fused with the result that they share the same transcriptional and translation start site and signal then the fusion protein which having gene a and gene b the gene a that is protein a and then gene b that is protein b they fuse together and having fusion protein a and b after that fusion vector the major goal in transcription it is turn dna into the rna as we all know central dogma of molecular biology dna into rna rna into protein so the dna transcribed into rna and rna translation into the protein that process also known as central dogma in this dna polymerase enzyme used to take part for dna and rna polymerase for the dna towards rna that is transcription then after that translation that is rna towards protein which is helped by ribosomes the gene fusion which is possible to engineer construct that consists from two different gene such construct are known as gene fusion the gene fusion after that carried out into chromosome that is having trans and cis side the green part that is known as telomere end pair short leads and mrna that is the junction that known as gene junction after that if the promoter that control coding sequence which is removed coding sequence fused to different regional place that is known as the promoter is used in the vector fusion after that the dna vector and rna vector translate by translation fusion and transcription fusion then translation gene fusion carried out by 5 prime in and transcription that is carried out by 3 prime in gene of the dna as we seen in the diagram gene on the dna which is primary transcribed having rna processing control the part of orange and blue that is assemble into nucleus and cytosol nucleus a dna cytosol in rna then rna transport control translation control is different gene fusion as we seen in the image fusion example that is gene of interest transcriptional gene fusion and translation gene fusion then the gene fusion that is it is possible in genetic engineering to construct segment of two different genes okay so after that as we seen in the diagram replication is carried out for vector that known as big picture okay that is all about
transcriptional and translation fusion vector.